What's poppin' guys? You go Pyre here with a Gilwar versus Absolute Void. Um, Absolute Void or AV are one of the legacy guilds, I guess. Like they've been they've been around for like I think since the start. They've been around for super long and they're like also still one of the strongest Guild Wars. I think they, they have one of the strongest Guild War defenses too. I, I guess I've said this about quite a few guilds. I said this about Pollen too. But <laughs> I guess I, I only do record versus like the stronger guilds. Um I have, a, I have a, like I know a bunch of people in this guild that I would like to hit, but like they're all not green. I want to hit DJ. I want to hit Nick. <laughs> I want to hit up Misha as well. Um, but I guess we can start with words, cause ooh, what is this? Um, <clears throat> all right. I do want to couple bulldoze at the top team. Um. Normally, I wouldn't copper bulldozer more long teams unless I'm confident. Uh, I didn't. Ch I I'm, versus on my friend list, by the way, but I didn't check because I, I literally just woke up less than ten minutes ago. But my logic here is that versus super try hard with RTA and RTA Molongs normally have a lot of speed, like upwards of two forty speed. And therefore they sacrifice some HP. I think I'll go with that. So I'll couple bulldoze at that top team. <coughs> and uh <coughs> Huh, for the bottom team. Should I use Tessaran? Tessaran Perna Arena? Hmm. I could do this. Do I kill off Tassara? I mean, sorry, do I kill off Laika first? If I do this, I kill off Laika first, it gets revived. Then we kill Laika again. Is that, is that the play? Or do we kill Ciara first? Wait, why do I have Rakuni? Ooh, that would have been real bad. Um. I have resist lead anyway. I could also bring Laika as an alternative to Perna. I guess, but he has no heal block. So Perna does give like heals in case Laika decides to target to Sara and stuff like that. I know Rina heals, but you know, if Rina is bomb stun and stuff, she has no, like my Rina has no speed, <laughs> plus 32. So um, if she got gets stunned by a bomb, it'll take like a while for her to cycle turns. <clears throat> It, pretty much right now, I'm just thinking, do I bring Perna or do I bring Laika? Um, I guess I kind of like Perna more because Perna heals, uh, Perna can violent proc and stun stuff I guess. Uh, yeah. We'll see if my uh, prediction was right and if it's like a fast Molong. I mean, it should be because like, I've watched yeah, I've watched like, you know, the YDCB videos, like the Invitational where like, um, yep, it died, where, um, what the YDCB Invitational where, um, Verse was part of and stuff like that, so, I mean, it makes sense, for RTA, um, for RTA having a fast Molong definitely makes sense. I mean, still, a fast Molong is definitely still a threat, even on Guild Wars, but it means that it's more copperable, haha. <laughs> <coughs> Alright, nice Sue. I know Will and everything, so in theory, I could have just Xeros this team. Alright, future note, I can Xeros this team. Alright, we landed Oblivion, nice, so this is dead. Uh, I guess we just pocket this. How much does this do? I need to know. That didn't look like it did much. All right, whatever. I'll, I'll just keep poking to Saren because um, yeah, <clears throat> I, I don't. Yeah, I, I'll just keep poking to Saren because the thing is, I also do have um, I also do have destroy runes on my Tessaren, so. Eventually, he's gonna get revived with like no HP. <laughs> and we work on Sierra here. This might be a little bit grindy if I don't like get some violent procs, which is which is normal. Like, it's fine. 
um, and expected as well. I kind of expect uh, this to be a bit grindier because Elder Drill, there's Elder Drill things. Might take a while. But I have Destroy Runes, so like uh, that's why after a while, eventually the process won't be like that long. I actually didn't expect to kill Sierra before Elder Drill revived the second time. I'm not, not even gonna lie. Which is really nice because this allows us to focus on Elder Drill and then kill Sierra. Nice. <coughs> nice. It's actually been so long since I've pulled AV. The last time I pulled AV was like proc ready days and not even like towards the end. It was like in the middle so it hasn't been ages since I pulled proc ready. I mean since I pulled um, AV. <coughs> I remember back then, Verse, whenever I pull AV, Verse will always be like, Pyro hit me! <laughs> alright, alright. <clears throat> so we got Verse. Um, I know Phantom's probably running some janky. Yeah, he has some, some nice, luxury Zeratu team. Um, who else? We hit Tish. I know Tish has a really nice Perna. Uh, ooh. This is an interesting team. And then, what's Mark running? Fermion? Yeah, he's running his Fermion in uh, I could hit up Tish. Sierra on Retash, because I kind of want to see how this team does. It's, uh, it's double wind, so... So yeah, uh, what do I kill first? Oh, he has support for his... Yeah, um, one thing I noticed with a lot of like Sierra Orion X teams is that the X normally doesn't provide enough support for Sierra because put put it in this scenario, if Sierra ever violent procs and double bombs Yorina and somehow kills it because you know Yorina wasn't at full HP um, and your Yorina gets double bombed and she dies because you know the Sierra didn't crit. Sierra is like a huge threat because she starts like bombing your fire units and stuff like that and it, it gets like it, it can be really devastating so like I mean I, I myself run Sierra Ryan well at least this week I'm testing out Sierra Ryan like it's been pretty good actually let me let me let me show yeah well actually it's not been pretty good my first team oh I got three wins in a row here but yeah it's been decent okay let I'll, I'll, I'll change it to like wait eh? Uh, that was three losses in a row. JK, AK has been pretty trash. Yeah, it's been pretty trash. But, yeah, I think support is really nice. That's why Sierra Ryan Perna was like the OG variant because Perna does have heal support. He violent procs like two. He moves two times, maybe three times. Um, yeah, Sierra actually heals a lot. So, I guess there is, there is, um, support for Sierra here. I guess I can expect a good Sierra. The Tish also does have a really good retouch. Um, let's see. Orion. <clears throat> Theo Orion Chasun. Do I put that much pressure on? I think I do. Theo Orion Chasun. I don't. I don't see why not. Where's my Chasun? All right. Cool. Obviously, I'm just sniping the Perna um, over and over again, hopefully. Uh, again, Perna versus like... Uh, I think I'll just take Perna, because... Laika gets... Um, Laika gets stunned by Orion, and then like I, I waste a whole turn, because I can't like file a proc out. I I'm going for Ciara. Did, did you did you see how many turns Ciara just got? Did, did, did anyone see that? I, I, I'm I'm scared. I'll get this monster out. Ah, oh, Valen prop, nice. That was scary. <laughs> did it just move like 27 million times? Uh, I'm not sure what I want to do here to be honest, but I think. Because if I had Laika here, I would go for Orion because Laika doesn't glance, but I I think I have to go for Ritesh here. I don't know how long it'll take me to kill Ritesh and like if Ritesh heals back Orion, all like the progress is wasted. All that chip damage is wasted, so I think 
I'll just go for retouch. It's also especially nice because it's easier to land armor break if I go for retash and I have destroy runes which <coughs> decrease the amount that he does and heals for. <clears throat> Aran is so annoying. Nice to getting some violent props back. I can start seeing the red on his HP on the on the retasher's HP bar, which means that uh we're doing good. <laughs> oh he didn't die? Alright, cool. It's dead now. Alright, we can auto. Oh boy, how long is it gonna take to solo an, an Orion, a single Orion? But yeah, um, anyways, I guess while we're watching, while we're watching an Orion attempt to 1v3 me, um, I'll be doing summons soon. I'm, I'm actually kind of nervous. <clears throat> I have over 200 summons, so hope I get something nice. Yeah, it'll be um after after um after toa reset if, if you guys are interested uh this is kill this shit snipe oh my god my theo sucks so much no all right but anyway yeah uh if you guys are wondering like if you guys want to know like the exact time and stuff it will be in the this there will be a countdown in the description this definitely doesn't kill because I'm not attacked. I'm so, I'm so lucky. I'm so lucky. <laughs> Holy, I'm, I'm so, I'm the luckiest player in the planet. <laughs> Always lucky. Oh boy. <clears throat> Damn, I got so lucky. I mean, at the same time, I, while I don't think this is like the best defense, I, I got so lucky, so I don't know how much I can say. Single threat normally, like, if I had like a Camilla as well, I'd do that. I, I could come like, if I felt like using, you know, if Theo died, I could just Camilla it, so. Sing or, or even Chao, Chao's, not even, even, Chao, Chao works really well as well, so. I guess the Bruiser Water units. <clears throat> Though his his perna is really good, so I got I was so lucky. Cause if his perna proc with just attack buff, it could kill my chest soon. Like that's how good it is, yeah, from memory at least. It's been a while since I looked at it. I looked at it last month, I think, when I was doing freedom removal. Yeah. <clears throat> I got lucky though. Not even gonna lie. Um, so I guess over here we have the option of hitting the Fermion defense Or hitting wait, what did I click me? Uh, I'm hitting this right. I guess there's a cracker defense too. Wow, everyone has luxury LD net fives. Karanthir doesn't, right? Yeah um, Let's see what can I do? Against this team, I might just bring the same boring team, so maybe I don't hit Mark because I I, I literally use that same team like twice in this go already. But how would I hit this? I would use Ciara and Messidy Bulldog. So I would bulldoze the Feng Yan, bomb the Orion, and then Fermion will get 10 billion damage because of this. But with bulldozer punches, maybe I can keep it stunned so I can get one bomb off. I think if I get one bomb off, I can set up a chain stun. That's what I would do. Uh, you know what? Whatever. Let's let's just hit him. Let's let's hit him. Seems fun. Seems fun. Uh, put the message here. I, I always make the mistake because like it's just nature for me like second nature for me to like pull the unit that's the furthest on the right because my team is like this Sierra 
I mean sorry, immensity bulldoze a copper. So I always just pull copper by default, which is the unit on the right. So whenever I it like I'm I just don't I don't even look sometimes. <laughs> so like I pull the wrong unit and it's a disaster. But <clears throat> okay, so we got this Sierra Bastet Perna. I think I definitely do. Uh, <coughs> is there a world where I try and Lucian this? I could. I could Lucian this, but I don't want to risk it. Uh. You know, if Chichi was here, Chichi would say, I would like a Bastet Perna this. And I kind of agree. I would like a Bastet Perna this too. <clears throat> Alright, I think I would do this. <coughs> yeah. Actually, no, the thing armor breaks. What's that armor breaks? So I want to resist lead over defense lead. Um, kill Ciara first, as usual. And kill Perna. Uh, I'm using Laika here because I want more damage. My Laika does more damage than Perna, so. I want the raw damage. Also, um, in case Perna goes ham and like kills Tassarion, like it gets bonus damage. So I don't, I don't really think that's gonna happen that much. <clears throat> yeah, Ooh, a bit laggy. <clears throat> All right, so step one. If we'll, if if Wind Panda doesn't die, that's a good chance. I mean, I, I'm pretty sure this is a triple HP Wind Panda. I, I came in knowing that that was a possibility. Just. Alright, cool. <coughs> cool. So we don't bomb that. And we get provoked. Nice, Sue. I guess I have to just keep reducing its attack bar. Please! Alright, cool. <clears throat> I need Orion gone. Oh, I, I missed the stun. I was gonna say, I need Orion gone because Orion's gonna stun stuff. And I need my monsters not stunned. Uh, I'm just gonna do this and slow. <clears throat> Alright, cool. We got one stun and I missed. Cl oh, never mind. <laughs> we get one stun and we should be able to set off like a chain of stuns with Sierra Bomb and stuff. <clears throat> cool. Yeah, that, that defense was fancy. Definitely though, if possible, I would have ran. Uh, I, I I put I, even though I'm like trying to kill Sierra, I put Oblivion on Perna just so in case I don't kill Perna doesn't heal. <clears throat> but yeah, uh, like if if my uh, bulldozer didn't kill, there's a very good chance that I would have lost that. See what I mean by like Perna procs on Tessarion, then Laika would do more damage? <laughs> this is exactly what's happening right now. Which is okay. It's okay. <clears throat> it, it, it was definitely expected. <clears throat> yeah, I'm gonna heal myself up here. The Resist Lee was a, was, was a good choice, definitely. Resist Lee was 100% the, the right lead there. I, I don't even know why I thought about using defense lead. It's like, Vestet is so annoying. She lands like, attack downs, armor breaks, glancing on Tessarion so he like misses armor breaks, stuff like that. It's like, really annoying. I'm, yeah. And I guess Sierra bombs as well. <clears throat> Anyways? We did it! Three wins versus AV. Yo, like my 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 record versus AV is so bad. I used to go like my be I think my best record back then because this was ages ago. This was when I was C three. Like never hit have have like never touched G one. My record against AV was like consistently three three. I think there was once where I went four two, but like I could never like that that was like my score. <laughs> that that was like that one lucky week too. If not, I normally went three three. <laughs> Or, or even worse, I've gone like w worse before, but anyways, 
that was Guild Wars vs. Absolute Void. Um, got to hit up a few friends, and and yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Um, I'll be doing once again. I'll be doing summons on uh, Monday, my time Monday Australia time after. It'll be like Monday night. Oh, um, after um TOA reset and after rush hour. The countdown will be in the description. And yeah, hope to see you guys in that stream or in next video, boy.